Welcome back guys. Uh, welcome back to Chance Review. So today got another video for you guys. Uh, so went to Trung Nam and decided to grab some other items. So it was drive through, so I went drive through, pick it up, got back here. But anyways, yeah, let me show you what they have here. So, I got, as far as what you guys saw so far, I got the coffee here. Yep, their coffee. Got their bao, the bun bao. I got a couple of the croissant. I got their cinnamon one. Yep. Cinnamon. And I got their almond here. Yeah, so. Let's try their bow first. So it tastes like first time trying this bow. But yeah, let's peel it. Like what they have here. They have pork inside. Let's try it out. So the bow is pretty good, I think. My mind for two dollars and fifty cents, I think it's pretty cheap. It's pretty tasty for two dollars bow. Uh, bread is soft. Uh, it's not dry as far as like other places they made. Like the bread is like big, but it's pretty dry. Uh, filling bread ratio is pretty good. Oh. Yeah, the filling vibration is pretty good. So there's barbecue pork inside. Uh, like I said, bread to filling ratio is good. Not a lot of bread, it's not a lot of meat. It's just perfect amount. I don't think you dropped anything on did you? I did. Keep on here, relax. Yeah. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Yeah, so the bread is good. I like it. Like I said, for $2.50, you can't beat this. I mean, when I saw this on the menu, I wasn't expecting much, especially since it was pretty cheap. I thought, ah, probably not gonna be that good, but I figured I would give it a shot. Since it's probably something new or it's probably been there in the pool while, but the last time we went there, they didn't have the bow. But I saw the menu, like I said, I saw the menu, saw it, I tried to give it a shot. Like I said, I wasn't expecting much, but then kind of took me by surprise because it's actually pretty decent. It's pretty good too. You know? Guys should definitely try this out too. Uh Trung Nam on uh, University Avenue. Try this. Mm -hmm. Talking. But let's try this cinnamon croissant here. So first time trying the cinnamon here. So cinnamon is not bad, uh, it's not the greatest, but it's still pretty tasty. It's like $2.50 for the cinnamon one, 
Yeah, so like I said, I haven't tried this before. Just thought to give it a shot. So it tastes like. I mean, like I said, it's okay. Uh, it's probably not the greatest. So let me try their almond croissant here. Like I said, first time trying the almond croissant as well too. Had the had the almond croissant from Misant. Uh, it was pretty good from Misant. Not sure how the croissant here tastes like. Almonds is pretty good. I like it too. I wouldn't say I like it too, but I like the almond. Uh, it's pretty good. Uh, it's not super sweet. It's really flaky. It's really buttery. It's totally different from how Misan does theirs. Misan, or compared to Misan, Misan their almond cream on top and almond filling as well. This one, you can taste the almond, but you don't have the almond filling in there. You don't have no almond cream on top or frosting so definitely check out Tron Elm uh, try out their their bun bao or their bao yeah it's pretty good you guys won't regret it uh, check out the croissant as well you guys want some croissant the croissant is pretty good uh, not bad they have a variety of other flavors as well they got like apple blueberry I believe strawberry and coconut too and regular yeah yeah so like i said you guys want croissant check them out as well uh they're located in university they're probably the first croissant place in st paul here that's been around for a while uh yeah so you guys like croissant check them out uh go support them until you guys see you guys in the next video take care